I am Dilip Jose, Managing Director and CEO of Manipal Health Enterprises. We, we run a large uh, network of hospitals across the country and I have been the CEO for about 7 years now. That's really great knowing you sir. As you have been in the healthcare industry since so long, like what do you feel like continuous learning is important in healthcare industry? Healthcare is a fast evolving uh, sector that you know not only uh, in, in uh, patient care, uh, the technology around uh, uh, is changing, the ecosystem is changing. So everybody involved in the healthcare sector, whether they are directly involved in patient care or managers like uh, me, we would need to be continuously learning, continuously understanding what is changing in the ecosystem and then ensure that we are all relevant to the current context. Therefore, I can't uh, really, really you know, overstate how important it is to be continuously learning and upskilling ourselves. Thank you for sharing that with us, sir. Uh, as with the emerging trends in the technology and all, uh, can you tell us like your perspective, what's the use of AI in healthcare and technology in healthcare? In, in my view, AI would be a, a great decision support system. You know, uh, unlike uh, people who apprehend that AI may replace people or healthcare workers, uh, I do not uh, uh, subscribe to that. I do think that uh, AI could be adding value in, in patient safety, in uh, ensuring uh, good outcomes in, uh, in decision making. I think AI is going to be a fact of life. I think the more that uh, we, we learn or we sort of realize how best to harness its capabilities, I think that is important. You said you certainly need safeguards. So, uh, you know, in a paradigm in which you would operate the AI, uh, any AI system, not only in healthcare, in any sector. I think give in, in, in uh, that perspective, keeping that, in, that perspective in mind, I think AI is going to be extremely relevant and uh, all of us in healthcare should look forward to using that. Thank you for sharing that, sir. Like, what made you motivated to be speaker in such conferences? I think it is, it is always a pleasure to catch up with colleagues. You know, uh, healthcare is a small world. Your colleagues are not only the people who work with you in your own company. I think it is colleagues are from across the sector. Conferences like this gives you an opportunity to meet up with a lot of people, exchange ideas, listen to more thoughts. I think that's the reason I came here. Uh, thank you for sharing that. So we have one more question. Like uh, Midwasti is a platform which offers online and blended learning courses for HCPs like uh, to upgrade themselves in the career to be more confident about the practice and we will be having even 60 plus case discussions like what do you take away on the live case discussions because the patient scenario might be different from case to case like what's your opinion on case based discussions learning from case based discussions. Case based studies are uh, great tools you know not only in, in, in medicine in management too case you know case method is, is, is considered to be the best way to teach a, a, a principle or you know or understand the context on the ground it is equally applicable for healthcare and many other fields i think it's a great idea to look at live examples and then mull over it to see what are the lessons that one could glean from that